नमस्कार विद्यार्थी मित्रांनो आजच्या व्हिडिओमध्ये आपण पाहणार आहोत इयत्ता अकरावी सब्जेक्ट इन्फॉर्मेशन टेक्नॉलॉजीचा चॅप्टर नंबर फोर सायबर लॉचे एक्झरसाईज सोल्युशन्स क्वेश्चन नंबर वन कम्प्लीट द फॉलोइंग वेब त्याचं ॲन्सर आहे फर्स्ट डू प्रॅक्टिस गुड पासवर्ड हायजीन सेकंड डू बी कॅज्युअल्स विथ पर्सनल इन्फॉर्मेशन थर्ड डू यूज प्रायव्हसी सेटिंग्स फोर्थ डू थिंक बिफोर यू क्लिक ऑर शेअर फिफ्थ डू अपडेट युअर डिव्हायसेस अँड सॉफ्टवेअर सिक्स डू बॅकअप युअर इम्पॉर्टंट डेटा क्वेश्चन नंबर टू कम्प्लीट द फॉलोइंग चार्ट ॲन्सर आहे फर्स्ट पासवर्ड क्रॅकिंग सेकंड ब्रूट फोर्स अटॅक्स थर्ड सोशल इंजिनिअरिंग फोर्थ फिशिंग फिफ्थ मालवेअर सिक्स एक्सप्लॉइटिंग सॉफ्टवेअर वॉलनरेबिलिटीज क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री फील फॉलोइंग बॉक्सेस विथ ॲप्रोप्रिएट सायबर क्राईम नेम फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन कॉपरेट वायोलेशन ऑफ सॉफ्टवेअर क्रिएटेड ओरिजिनली बाय अन इंडिव्हिज्युअल ॲन्सर आहे सॉफ्टवेअर पायरसी सेकंड गेनिंग ॲक्सेस विदाउट द युजर्स परमिशन ॲन्सर आहे अनऑथराइज ॲक्सेस थर्ड एक्स्ट्रॅक्टिंग कॉन्फिडेन्शियल इन्फॉर्मेशन बाय ईमेल ॲन्सर आहे फिशिंग क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर रीड द फॉलोविंग अँड ॲन्सर द क्वेश्चन राहुल लॉस्ट हिज पेन ड्राईव्ह इन हिज कॉलेज कम्प्युटर लॅब हिज क्लासमेट माधव फाइंड्स इट ही कॅरीज इट होम टू रिटर्न इट टू हिम द नेक्स्ट डे वेन माधव ओपन्स इट ही फाइंड्स हिज फेवरेट गेम He thinks of making a duplicate copy of the game software. First question, does Madhav think ethically? Answer is no. Second, what do you think should Madhav do? Answer, Madhav should return back pen drive without making duplicate copy of game. Third, if he makes a duplicate copy, then which cyber crime will he commit? Answer, software piracy. Question number 5. Answer in brief. First question, What care should be taken by the user while doing online activities? Answer When engaging in online activities should take the following precautions. First, strong and unique password. Create and use strong unique password for each online account to minimize the risk of unauthorized access. Second, phishing awareness. Be casual of suspicious email messages or websites that attempt to devise into revealing personal information avoid clicking on unknown links or downloading attachment from untrusted sources third regular software updates keep your operating system antivirus software and other applications up to date to ensure you have to latest security patches and bug fixes fourth secure wifi networks connect to trusted and encrypted wifi networks especially when transmitting sensitive information Avoid using public Wi-Fi for sensitive transaction or use a virtual private network means VPN for added security. Fifth, privacy settings. Review and adjust privacy settings on social media platforms and other online services to limit the amount of personal information exposed to the public. By following these precautions, user can enhance their online security and protect their personal information from unauthorized access. Second question, define the terms first ethics and second moral answer is first ethics ethics refers to moral principles and values that guide individual and societies in the determining what is right or wrong good or bad and what ought to be done in various situations it involves the study of moral judgments choices and actions as well as the analysis of concepts such as duty virtue fairness and responsibility ethics provides a framework for evaluating human behavior and help us understand how to make decision that are morally acceptable second moral moral relates to the principle of the right and wrong behavior and the distinction between what is considered good and evil or acceptable and unacceptable it pertains to personal beliefs values and codes of conduct that influence an individual actions and choices morality often involves the development of a moral compass based on societal norms religious or philosophical beliefs and personal experiences third question explain three example related to unauthorized access answer example related to unauthorized access first unauthorized access to computer system this refers to gaining unauthorized entry into computer system networks or database without proper permission or authority it could involve exploiting vulnerabilities in the system bypassing security me- measures or using stolen credential to gain access 
unauthorized access is a violation of ethical and legal standard as it breaches the privacy and security of individuals or organizations second unauthorized access to personal information this examples involves unauthorized individual accessing someone's personal information without their knowledge or consent it can occur through hacking phishing or social engineering techniques unauthorized access to personal information can lead to identify theft financial loss and invasion of privacy ethically concern arises when personal data is misused or exploiting for fraudulent purposes third is unauthorized access to intellectual property this refers to unauthorized acquisition use or distribution of intellectual property such as copyrighted material trade secret or proprietary information it includes activity like illegal downloading or sharing copyrighted music movies or software which violates intellectual property rights and undermines the rights of creator and content owners ethically unauthorized access to intellectual property is considered a form of theft and can harm the creative industries fourth question explain software piracy and hacking answer software piracy software piracy involves the unauthorized copying distribution or use of software without proper licensing or permission from the copyright holder it often occurs when individuals or organizations make unauthorized copies of software programs sell counterfeit software or distribute software without adhering to licensing agreements software piracy is a form of intellectual property infringement and it consider unethical and illegal hacking hacking refers to act of gaining unauthorized access to computer system or networks with the intention of exploring manipulating or compromising their security hackers often use their technical skill to exploit vulnerabilities break into systems steal sensitive information disrupt services or cause damage while hacking can sometimes be done for ethical purpose known as ethical hacking or penetration testing unauthorized hacking with malicious intent is illegal and unethical it violates privacy compromises data security and can have serious consequences for individual and organizations question number 6 state true or false first question firewall is used to encrypt transmission of data answer false second the standard of behaviors principle of right or wrong is referred as moral answer is false third hacking bank account related information is an example of software piracy answer is false fourth phishing is representing someone else work as own without permission answer false question number 7 match the following answer is first copying a game file answer is c software piracy second law related to internet answer is d cyber law third network security answer is a firewall fourth system crashes suddenly answer is b cyber threat question number 8 observe the following pictures and give your opinion about it by responding to the following questions first question is b's response correct or not answer is no b's response not correct second what will be the consequences of b's reply answer crucial information like otp in hand the fraudster can easily carry out illegal financial transaction using b's identity third which type of cyber crime does the picture depict answer fake calls fraud tar mitranno asha prakare yatta 11 vi subject information technology cha chapter number 4 cyber law che exercise solutions hote mitranno ha video awadla asel te ha video like kara aplya channel var navin asal ta channel subscribe kara ani mitranno hi pdf download karaycha asel te description check kara bhetao lavkar pudcha video madhe to parant dhanyawad